Hey, what's up guys, JDK Productions here, and today I will be reviewing the 20th Anniversary Snow Speeder. This set is for ages 7 and up, and has 309 pieces, and retails for about $40 in the US, which is a little pricey for just a snow speeder and some turret, and for minifigures. I really like this set for a 20th Anniversary set. It's a little pricey and expensive for $40 for a snow, for a snow speeder, when other speeders have been like $20 or $30. I think just because this is 20th anniversary, it bumps up the price, but it's still a good snow speeder, and I'm glad to have this set. So, for this review, let's start with the minifigures first, and then go to the set. Alright, the first minifigure we're taking a look at is a Rebel Trooper. This trooper has the old gun that they used to use with some figures. Um, he has nice torso printing, some tan legs, take off his his hat or helmet. He has no double sided face and you can take like this little like glasses sort of thing off. And you can put it on like that. So then he's kinda in like snow mode. He has a backpack. Underneath he has back printing, but you can't really see that with the backpack on. And that is a rebel trooper. So let's move on to the next minifigure. Alright guys, the next minifigure we're taking a look at is Dak Ralter. This character has very nice leg printing, very nice torso printing, very nice back printing, and he has the Rebel helmet. He has a regular Rebel helmet. I don't know why they didn't use the new Rebel helmet that was in some other sets, but it's fine. I kind of like this one better. He has a happy face, and then on the back, and like, oh no face. And that's pretty much Dak. He has a little pistol. So, let's move on to the next minifigure. Alright guys, the next minifigure we're taking a look at is Luke Skywalker. And like Dak, he has really nice leg printing, torso printing, and back printing. Flipping him back around, we see that he has a lightsaber, and a little pistol, and a rebel helmet. I don't know why uh, Dak's helmet is blue and his is red, but maybe that's correct. And we see he has one face, and then if we flip this around, he has another face. At first I thought this was a misprint because it had the little glasses above his eyes, and I thought that was kind of weird, but it's it shows it on the box, so I think it's correct. So, that's Luke Skywalker. Let's move on to the next minifigure. The next minifigure we're taking a look at is Lando Calrissian. And he has his own little stand that says 20 years Lego Star Wars, 1999 to 2019, Lando Calrissian. Taking him off the stand, you can see, we can see that Lando has a cape that's yellow on one side and blue on the other. He has regular black legs, some torso printing, and on the back he has 20 years of Lego Star Wars. And no double sided face for Lando. He has the old blaster that they used to use, and this minifigure only came in one other set, which was the Cloud City set way back when. I like this minifigure, and I'm glad they included him in the set. Now let's move on to the to reviewing the set. Alright guys, we're going to start off with this turret we're going to review, and taking a look at it, we can see that it can spin full 360 degrees, it can move up and down, and then... This part can turn if you would like it. it. has a stud shooter, which you can just push down and shoot it out. Just like that. Then, flipping it over, we can see that there's where you can put your little rebel trooper, I guess. And have him control it. And then also, right here, there's a little spot for his gun. Which you can put down like that. And then, flipping it back around, we see that there are some binoculars for the Rebel Trooper to use. And that's the gun turret. Let's move on to the snow speeder. Alright guys, taking a look at the snow speeder, we can see that you can lift this up, and inside there's a seat for Luke Skywalker in the front and Dak in the back, and on this there's a control panel, and looking right there there's a control panel. So let me get those two minifigures right now. Put Luke Skywalker in the front, 
just like that and put DAC in the back sorry it's kind of hard to get them in just like that then you can close it up and they're in there very nicely taking a look at the back we see that there's another stud shooter which you just push like that and that's a stud shooter then there's the tow cable which you can bring down just like this and have it wrap around your AT, at if you like if you have one and then you can bring it back up you can also like just lift this up but it tends to break off a lot and then put it back down it has regular turrets at the front you can also lift these little flaps up right here showing more stickers then looking underneath we see that there's some spring-loaded shooters which you just push down on them like this and they fire out and just like that and they fire out and that is pretty much the snow speeder there's a lot of stickers in this set and, you, and there's the pilots once again and I like the snow speeder but a lot of snow speeders are very similar and this is one of them alright guys thank you guys so much for watching this review make sure to like and subscribe if I get to 50 subscribers I'll do a giveaway and I hope you like this review. Make sure to comment down below what you think of this review and what you would like to see next. Make sure to subscribe so I can do a giveaway. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.